And in neighboring Honduras, thousands of people over the past month have gone to the streets to protest against corruption there, especially against embezzlement from the Social Security Institute. More than $350 million were embezzled from that institution. Now, the protests usually occur at night, and protesters use torches representing the patients that died because lack of funding for public health. We bring you this preview of next week's episode of Telesur's program, Inside the Americas. Hundreds of nighttime demonstrations have brought Hondurans out onto the streets with their torches. The protesters are not only demanding an end to corruption, but justice for those who have stolen from the public purse. Recent investigations have found that many from the ruling National Party were involved in the embezzlement of more than $350 million from the Social Security Institute. The government has claimed the torches are being smuggled in. But Ricardo Rivas, a retired teacher and carpenter, explains the real reason why there are so many torches at the demonstrations. Lately, seeing the demonstrations of people against the government, I thought of making my own torches with glass bottles of baby food and bamboo. We're also using used food cans. We cut the bamboo just like the torches they sell, and you can see that they are the same and they work well. Look at it. The store-bought torches got nothing on these. We just have to put the kerosene fuel, and it will be ready for use. I can help anyone if they bring me the material. A month ago, various checks came to light that used ghost companies to siphon off public funds. The money was supposedly used in the political campaign of current President Juan Hernandez in 2013. These revelations helped spur the social movement now known as the Demonstration of Torches. We decided to make them because in Tegucigalpa the torches were running out. I wanted to buy four or five to give away, and they told me there were no more. They say that necessity creates the industry, and I started making them myself. We cut them into four parts, and then we thought how to add the flame and the fuel. So we got soda cans and made a hole in them and put kerosene fuel and the string. This one that we did has lasted 10 hours. I have used it in two demonstrations already, and that is what many others have done. The torches are the symbol of a movement that brings together people from different professions and classes demanding an end to corruption. And it's a movement made up of many young people who are learning to join forces to put pressure on the government. 